now with our great American cookout, a look at how to throw a scale back party during the holiday. And we asked top chef star Eric Adjipong to create a pop-up picnic you can take anywhere. We'll speak to him live in just a moment. But first, take a look at this. Good morning, America. What's going on? This is Chef Eric Adjipong here. Very excited to show you guys how I picnic my way. First, Eric whips up the spicy marinade for his jerk chicken skewers. His special recipe of spices, citrus, onion, garlic, and hot scotch bonnet peppers goes into the blender. Next, marinate the chicken for at least 15 minutes, but even better if you can do it overnight. Then, cut the chicken into pieces and skewer. Now, it's time to hit the grill until the skewers are perfectly charred. And of course, no picnic without a side dish. Eric has a twist on potato salad. Boil the potatoes, then saute in butter until crispy. And make the sweet, sticky glaze with honey, shallots, and an African spice blend called bear bread. Now, head on outside. GMA, it looks like uh, Janelle's over there getting ready for the picnic. Lennox, you ready? Let's do it. All right, Chef Eric, his wife Janelle, and the daughter Lennox joining us from their backyard in Maryland to unpack the picnic. Now, Chef, that, the, my note here says you have a can't miss, one can't miss trick for pulling off the perfect picnic. Like, I'm a little skeptical that there's one trick for this. It's not that big of a deal, I promise you, man. It's really just, honestly, uh, preparing ahead, really. I think uh, when it comes to being with your family in a picnic, you want to enjoy the people, you want to enjoy the moment, you want to enjoy the time. So uh, breaking it up as much as possible, doing you know the, the dishes a little bit ahead of time is, is perfect for you. Uh, so you can really just enjoy the drink, enjoy your family, exactly what I'm doing. You're enjoying that moment. You got the family out there. Let's talk about the main course here. How are you dressing up those skewers for the of picnic? Course. Totally. So we had some jerk chicken skewers that were marinating beautifully. We're just going to go ahead and add in our pickled vegetables right on this lettuce wrap right there. Nice and beautiful. Just like that. Up next, I have this beautiful roasted potato salad. I'm going to add in a little bit of my Bebetti shallot glaze right on top of that right there. Give that a quick mix. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. I love, love, love this East African spice paired with that honey. We'll add a little bit of chives just for color. And then last but not least, guys, we have our delicious Sobolo sorrel drink. It's a drink of the diaspora. Um, I absolutely love it. We have hibiscus, pineapple, cinnamon, clove. There's orange, there's ginger. There's a whole bunch of deliciousness in there. It's one of my favorite drinks to have. Oh, I, I was waiting on you to say rum, but you had me, you had me going for a second. <laughs> <there>. Rum optional. <laughs> uh, you, you talked about the, the rum spice. is definitely optional for sure. <laughs> okay, you said you talked about the spice. You 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 added on there the uh, that seasoning that glaze. Now, how spicy are we talking? That too Absolutely. spicy for your your daughter, the little one you have, or? I mean, on a scale on a scale of one. I mean, on a scale of one through ten, it's probably about a seven. It's really moderate. Um, it's absolutely delicious, though. I think it really pairs well with the uh, with that honey glaze as well. Seven oh, is moderate. <laughs> seven is moderate. <laughs> I don't know. She, she looks that is like my little one right there. <laughs> she looks like it might be just a little bit too spicy for Lenny this morning. Uh, but hey, Eric, I, I wanted to ask you though. Uh, you had me a potato salad. That that's my thing at the uh, at the cookout and the picnic. I eat it before, during, and after the main course. But you've got a crisp twist on this thing. Tell us about it. Absolutely. So what we did is really just kind of basted it in its own butter um, and it kind of just allowed it just to crisp up really beautifully. We have some tomatoes that are just nice and all in season. Um, salted that really simply and then that burberry honey glaze like we spoke about. Um, just equal parts of honey, that burberry spice, a little bit of shallots in there. Super simple, something that you can make ahead of time that'll last really well um, and it's absolutely delicious. All right, Chef, always good to see you. Our best to the family, all the recipes and info to take a thank class. You, thank you, thank class you guys. With Eric is on our website. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.